Anyhow, let's go on to game two against the squids. So, Lisa will have her juice back, so we'll swap them. I like Jocinda's shortstop, honestly. She's doing a good job, and I like Kenny at first base. He's catching everything. Batting order's nice and good. Let's play! Here we are at another exciting game in the official BBL Ultra Grand World Championship of the Universe Series. I'm Sunny Day, and together with my pal, Vinny the Gooch, we'll bring every bit of the action to you. Playing in today's game are the Inky Squids and the Junior All-Stars. The series stands at one to nothing. And these kids are hanging tough in the Ultra Grand World Championship of the Universe Series, ready to win it all. And now, kids, it's time for some action. Don't hold back, fans. Show the All-Stars how much you want them to win. Well, we all want the All-Stars to win. Even the squids want the All-Stars to win. It just feels right. On the mound today is... We're pitching first again. <laughs> if it curves or catches fire, Mad Dog can throw the head See you, Marty. Just Have a good time doing homework. Slow, slow Watch me now. Hey, Julie Dunkel steps up to bat. Alrighty, Julie Dunkel at first at bat. We're gonna keep doing our cheesy pitching strategy. A bouncing ball. Got it. I don't want him getting home runs. <laughs> that was close. She's a fast little bugger. All right, Papa. <laughs> Ready now. Pitch on the way. He'll love Papa's pizza. Chopper to third. Um, Dimitri, now it's not the time to do a belly flop. Um, that should not have been an out, but okay, I'll take it. <laughs> I would have been ticked if that happened to me, but you know what? I'll take it. <laughs> okay, Xena. Xena's the slow one, so even if she gets a hit, that's no big deal. So they're actually hitting the ball quite a bit this time around, but that's okay, because they're still not able to get on base. The key is, I just, I can't throw a slow ball or a heat right over the plate. That would be a horrible error. Getting struck out. I just realized, we have someone named Xena and someone named Xenon. That's kind of interesting. All right. <laughs> Starting off with the best, Pete, Kenny, and Pablo. I I, I want to get have Pete Wheeler get another home run in this tournament. Cause I think he hasn't gotten a home run since game like four or something. And he on it, he's a really good batter. He deserves more home runs. Don't run, Pete. Don't run, Pete. Save your juice. Save your juice box. The stretch, pitch on the way. Swung on. All right, pop well, pop fly. Good effort, Pete, but they're gonna catch that. Nice try. <laughs> you will not be able to sweep. I'm not gonna be streaming for that one. I, I can't picture this going past 10 or 10 for Maybe that's optimism bias, though. I swear Kenny is powerful. I swear he can get home runs. But... Maybe I just got super lucky in the past. But I would love to see Kenny get a home run. If Jorge could do it, Kenny can do it. Ah, uh, it's another easy out. out. Alright, they're on they're on point with the fueling today. Oh my gosh! Pablo with his point eight one two batting average. That is absolutely insane. But also pretty accurate. From the wind up, pitch on the way. Right, that's not a home run. But he might get on base. Oh, he's gonna get on base! Okay, their catcher is fast. No bunting of rounders today. All right, Keisha. You're very much hit or miss, but... We all know when you hit it, you can hit it hard! Don't catch that. Wow. 
caught that without even in the slightest difficulty. All right, this is going to be a tougher game. They know our strategy now, and they're countering it. The stretch and the throw. The swing. A bouncing ball. Pitcher makes the catch. And the throw to first. Nice job, Lisa. Nice job, Kenny. Leah Wayne steps up. Leah Wayne, all right. All right, Leah Wayne, you think you're so great because you've got maxed out stats. Guess what? We don't need max stats. We have we have real intelligence and teamwork <laughs> and six people in Twitch chat that are cheering us on. Lisa, stay where you are. This is for Tony. That's for Tony. That, way to go, Lisa. I mean, you still moved off the pitcher's mound, but you still moved off the pitcher's mound, but at least you didn't bump into him and try to catch him for yourself. She's not even that fast. And Tony's got a cannon. That's a big mistake. That's a big mistake. Although, admittedly, because Tony is slow, bunting is not necessarily a bad idea if they have someone with Pete Wheeler's speed. All right. We got two skilled batters and one pretty bad batter. I've got it out this pitcher, so I know what throws are coming. All right, Dimitri. Can you get us the first point of the game? Well, one back. No power. I believe in you. You got your great mismatching socks and your big blue pants. Okay, that was that was a very good hit. You just need to aim it a little bit more to the right. I mean, that wouldn't, that wouldn't have been a home run even if it was fair. But still, that would have probably been a uh, single. A swing. Line back. Yes, in between their second baseman and their shortstop. Just like that, Dimitri, you're not fast enough to be able to outrun their rockets. Well, if they drop it, maybe you would have been. Yeah, it's, a, it's definitely a defensive battle right now. Both of our fieldings are on point. Mm, get home run, you must. He winds fire. <laughs> Those heats can be really hard to determine if they're going to be balls or not because you have almost no time. From the lineup and the delivery. That's the ball. By the way, I like your Sonic shoes, Here's Tony. The motion, the one, one, Tony is literally wearing Sonic Runner shoes. First, with nobody else. The motion, the pitch. The Darn it. No, just. Just stay, Dimitri. Just stay. And that's an out. That first Whew. It out. Whew. That was close. Here comes Jorge Garcia. Watch that outfield cringe as I step up to the plate. I can't breathe a sigh of relief yet, though, because, I mean, Jorge is not particularly great. Maybe he got a batting increase. I wish I could see for Ready sure. Now, the pitch. Long on. A long drive. That's a solid hit, but they're going to catch that. Dimitri, hot. No. This is going to be a double play. To the first, and that's Ouch. That hurts. And that blows up the I can't believe they caught that. Jane Xenon and Fred. Black haired characters. All right. All right. I'm not. I'm not scared. Although I do have to be very careful with my pitching because they, if they get a home run, it's gonna be bad news bears. That's a pretty good hit. Jorge, I believe in you. Okay, not anymore. Oh, but they're being stupid and trying to go to second. And that's a big mistake! Honestly, if they had stayed on first, that would have be been much better for them. But the computer player just gets pretty greedy, I'll be honest. I am not using the heat against a team that is filled with maxed out batters. No way, no how. All right, Pete. All right, Pete. Stop running in circles and just grab the ball. Over to second. 
All right, they got a single. That's the thing. Pete won't stop running. You can't make him stop in a specific spot. You just keep running past it, which is annoying. But we have a double play opportunity because whatever is Xenon on first is not particularly fast. Okay, more strikeout. We'll take that too. And they're back to dunks. Well, we'll see about that. Let's give her some left hooks, especially since she's hitting closed. I'm wasting a fireball or a big freeze yet. Maybe for the final. No, because Elise is up to bat this inning. I don't want to. I don't want to guess her. Don't try this at home, kids. I want her to at least have some stamina. Boom. Yeah, this is less fireworks than the cookies. It's true. I mean, we could get, we could see a home run this inning. We have just an and Pete. Lisa could also potentially <laughs> have something up her sleeve. <sighs> now, a line drive with Justin would be stupid. I literally just have to pray for a home run. Nope. Right to her. Right to Dunkel. Darn it. As amusing as it would be to try to get a home run with Lisa, it's just not realistic, and I need a point. So I'm going to try hitting wide drive just to see if she can get a single, and maybe Pete can get a two-man home run. You have to understand, our team and the Squids won both of the games in the earlier tournament. They didn't, we didn't lose. Darn it, easy out. All right, Pete Wheeler. You've come close to hitting home runs this uh, the championship. It's time to actually make it happen. Uh, what am time I to make it happen, Pete. Again? You hit it and then you run. It'll be a hit and run. I feel like closed gets the most home runs. The wind up, Rose. Turn it, Pete. Chopper to third. That little blooper sent him running. Yeah. Ooh, that's not what yep. For. Scoreless tie for the that's first three innings. Third this third is. No score in this this is a bit of a boring game. The stars are really giving him the business, but they're giving it right back. What a game! Chico Papa steps up to bat. Right, Chico. Vamos. From the windup, pitch on the way. The swing. A bouncing ball. Jorge. There we go, Lisa. You're learning. You don't have to leave the mound for everything. Lena Frome. I'm sorry, Zena, not Lena. Nice job. Nice hustle, Jorge. Nice hustle. Jorge's, honest, he, Jorge's kind of on his fielding game right now. He's doing really well. I, I like appreciating my teammates when they do things right. <laughs> and and raging slightly when they do things wrong. <laughs> okay, that's not what you want to see. Let's let's get him out with the fireball. Okay, yeah, we had to get him out. He's he's a powerhouse. I mean, I think they're all powerhouses, but he he's especially in a powerhouse. Kenny Pobble Keish. All right. No, I'm going line drive with Kenny. Home run's just not gonna happen. If we if we had a point, I would hit. I would drive for Okay, get it past. No. Gotta watch your kneecaps on She's the wall. Zena's the wall. I know these kids can keep it together out there. 
All right, Pablo. You have been extraordinarily promising this tournament. Sorry, this championship. Let's see the classic Pablo home run power. That's a big mistake. That's a big mistake. You never do fastball on the right side of the strike zone for Pablo. Ever. 398. That was impressive considering it barely made it over the fence. All right. Now we're in the position I want to be in. In the lead. Also, how did they get a blimp indoors anyways? This is an indoor stadium, but they hired a blimp to fly through. Oh, right. <laughs> Thanks, Finny. I was wondering if we were going to have to go into overtime. <laughs> All right. I do believe this game is now in the bag. We can't be careless, but we're in a good position now. All right, Keisha. That was that was a little bit disappointing. That was just a just a little bit disappointing. He comes center, the plate. That's foul. A blooper in foul territory. Darn it, that would have been a great hit. Don't, don't catch that. Are you <sighs> Yeah, their fielding is really good, man. Their fielding is too good. I've determined the optimum swing based on All right, but we've got, we've got the power of the Petrovich on our team. on the way. Okay. I, be, I think I selected power, not grounder, but apparently not. Yeah, that's an out. That's fine. We scored this inning. That's all I really wanted. All right. Leo Wayne, Debbie Kawasawa, and then Jim. Oh, my gosh. Leo and Debbie are. Remember that two-handed batter a couple of seasons ago? Yes, Vinny. We, we all recall. We all recall. All right. Leo Wayne. Uh -oh. We still don't have juice. Nice, nice hustle, Lisa. All right, I think I think we need to give Lisa a little bit of a rest. The coach calls timeout. She's got to recuperate her juice. Kenny Kawaguchi up on the mound and from the stretch, pitch on the way. The swing, the right one. It was in there like. Yeah, that reminds me if. For next season, if if I end up getting rid of Kenny, I'm, I'm probably going to get rid of Kenny. And if I end up getting rid of Lisa as well, I'll need two pitchers. Okay, Jacinda. Good. Even with the iron boots, she's still made it first. I'm going to have to find a, main, a new main pitcher and a new substitute pitcher. Because these two are kind of the only ones who I want pitching. I mean, Pablo and Pete can pitch, but they shouldn't because that will lower their speed, which is some of the best aspects of them. Nice job, Kenny. We really don't. All right. Our last at bat, Tony Jorge Joseph. <laughs> yes, everyone eat your high fiber cereal. And thanks to Spy Fox, you can even have it with milk. Let's see what you got. All right, Tony. Let's see what you're made of. The stretch and the throw. That was ball one, but nobody out. Tony is itching to hit this. Into the wind, throws it. Swing. Foul ball. Tony is itching to hit this forwards. Come on, Tony. That's going to be a ball? No, of course not. One and two. Tony wouldn't have been able to get a home run off of that. Fastball to the right, please. Well, that's an easy out if I've ever seen one. And Sorry about that, Tony. All right, Jorge. Okay, stand back, peons. You'd best be afraid of this kid and his necktie. When you least expect it, he'll smack a deaner out of the park. 
A bouncing ball. But for the most part, he hits grounders and is too slow to get to first base. Ah, uh, right, Jorge. I honestly didn't expect that much. Speaking of not expecting much. Powerful hit, but that's gonna be good, right? No! Oh, she got a concussion. Oh, excellent. You are too slow to go to second, though. Bother, though. Uh, Lisa, Lisa, I need you to get on base. I need you to hit, get on base. Actually, I don't need you to because I am a point ahead. But if you get on base and Jocinda gets to second, we can have Pete Wheeler come by and potentially get a home run. Or you could do that. And she goes down. Runner on first, two out. I'm gonna try for power actually, get it a little more distance. The stretch, the delivery. That was the same distance. Oh yeah, at least there was no. Never mind, I forgot Lisa was completely out of juice. There was no way she was getting on first unless I got a home run. As long as we can stop them from scoring, we win. And we can finish up the championship tonight. Alright, well, Lisa's still kind of low on juice, so I don't want to bring her back in unless I have to. Alright, Dimitri. Nice job. Man, I'm liking Dimitri on third. He's doing a good job. All right, Fred Benson. You're, you're a long way from the mystery machine, Fred. Okay, maybe I should bring Lisa back in. Um, why, why did you not throw it to second like I told you to? That was weird. I don't know why they threw it to Tony at first when my cursor wasn't over there, but all right. Yeah, this is... Kenny's not working out. I have to put Lisa back in. Actually, Not Pete. Because this is going to be the last inning, I don't care if Pete loses his juice. I really don't. We're just trying to stop them from scoring. I normally do not recommend putting Pete Wheeler as your pitcher, because if he gets tired, then he is very slow and loses his greatest strength. But again, last inning doesn't matter. Alright. Oh my gosh, she was. Oh no, but it's Dimitri. Double play that game! They tried, but they forgot that my basement have cannons. What a great bunch of kids. They're gonna be hooting and hollering at the mall tonight. From the Super Colossal Dome, this is Sunny Day and Minnie the Gooch signing off. All right, that was a good game. I mean, that was a boring game, and we barely won, but we won. That's two games now. As soon as we win another one, we win the trophy. I don't know why they tried to make him go to third. Maybe they thought Kenny wouldn't have the arm to throw it all the way there before he could run, but they thought wrong. Kenny's got a good arm. He needs to have a good arm because his legs aren't working too well. All right, zero to one. I'll take that win. And because we won last game, I think we are safe to try for a third game tonight. Because I'm, I'm confident we can win the third game and win, end the championship this stream. And we'll probably finish before 10 o'clock.